Hello everyone. How are you going? Welcome back to another video. What is a DMZ? This is what we are going to talk about in this video. DMZ stands for demilitarized zone. At the most basic level, DMZ is used to enhance the security of a company's network by isolating devices like servers and computers on the opposite side of a firewall. So it's like creating two different networks. But the real question is why do you need to do this and how does a DMZ achieve this? Let's take an example for a better understanding. Here we have a network that belongs to an organization and this organization has devices such as computers and servers behind a firewall. And these servers need to be accessed by public users from the internet so the organization can stay in touch with business. So for instance these servers can be web server email server dns server ftp server and so on now as you can see these servers are behind the organization's firewall in simple words they are inside the organization's local area network or private network this means that this organization is letting in everyone from untrusted network like public internet and you are giving access behind the organization's firewall and also into the local area network or private network where the servers are located so if this happens it would create a security issue because as people are accessing these servers cyber criminals can also take it as an easy way to get into the private network and cause damage because you have given access and they have already passed through the firewall as the servers are placed behind the firewall so cyber criminals can steal sensitive information from other devices that are behind the firewall like database server where the secret data is kept even they can install a malicious virus on other devices so this is a major security concern however what if the organization allow public access to web and email servers outside the organization's private network and put them on the opposite side of a firewall now as you can see servers are still in the same area but on the other side of a firewall so now if people access these servers from the public internet they are not going to access them behind the organization's internal firewall where the organization's private data is kept these servers are now in front facing the public internet and completely exposed this is what basically DMZ is all about. These servers are now in a DMZ, which is also called perimeter network. This network can act like a screen network to detect any evil activity before it can get behind the firewall and into the organization's private network. So the whole idea behind DMZ is it separates a network into two parts by taking devices from inside the firewall and then placing them outside the firewall now the most important part of the video as you can see this dmz setup is using only one firewall but for a more secure dmz you can deploy two firewalls additional firewall will be put in front of a dmz this additional firewall adds an extra layer of security and makes sure only legal traffic access the dmz as a result, DMZ makes it more difficult for a hacker to gain access to an organization's private network because they would have to go through two different firewalls if they want to get into the internal network. If an attacker is able to penetrate the external firewall and compromise a system in the DMZ, they then also have to get past an internal firewall before gaining access to sensitive corporate data. Remember, the main goal of a DMZ network is to allow an organization to access untrusted networks such as internet while ensuring its private network remains secure. Advantages of a DMZ Enhanced Security DMZ provides an additional layer of security by isolating public-facing services from private internal resources. Controlled Access DMZ allows organization to regulate and monitor traffic flow between internal networks and external networks, reducing the risk of unauthorized access. Mitigation of external threats DMZ helps in preventing cyber attacks 
एंड अनऑथराइज इंट्रोजन अटैम्प्ट टारगेटिंग पब्लिक फेसिंग सर्विसेज All right so this brings me to the end of my video thanks for watching please subscribe if you liked the video